boxes and boxes of food, along with rows of cars. Government officials and volunteers alike all joined force today to help the Greater Pittsburgh Community Food Bank distribute food to those who need it. Organizations all throughout the Pittsburgh area have had to modify their operations after the implementation of social distancing. The Greater Pittsburgh Food Bank was one of them. The state and city of Pittsburgh started putting limits on the number of people who could gather in certain places. Um, that's when we really started to look at ways that we needed to modify our work. As the organization's communication and public relations specialist, Melissa Murray, explains, since they could no longer perform their usual operations, the solution was a drive-up food distribution. So we knew we couldn't do those safely. Um, and so the best way to serve people right now is to do that really through their cars. So we're having drive-up food distributions right now. Those who wish to receive food can meet in a line at one of the food bank's selected locations where they will gradually drive up to a volunteer who will load a box of food into the back of their vehicle. The drive-up distributions have definitely been um, a work in progress, but we feel like we're in a good place now where we've kind of got the hang of things and we're able to find more places outside of Pittsburgh where we can serve people as well. The distribution at the Pittsburgh International Airport marked the food bank's 10th drive-up distribution and fed over 800 people with the help of many volunteers and some government officials, including Connor Lamb. We actually only served just over 800, so we served 812 vehicles, um, but we needed space for 1,500 cars in case um, that many were to come, and actually even more than that. Despite some challenges in the planning process, the events have been considered rather successful. It's been pretty incredible to hear the um, words of gratitude from people. You know, even if they're just coming to a distribution and getting two boxes of food, um, you don't know what that might mean to that person. The Greater Pittsburgh Community Food Bank mentioned that they will be holding similar events at PPG Paints Arena, Beaver County, and Butler County, just to name a few. Reporting for RMU Century Media, a safe social distance away from the Pittsburgh International Airport, I'm John Blinn.